Good morning, sunshine. I'm looking a little rough today, but, um, and I don't have my glasses on, so don't come for me in my eyes. But, um, I just got done doing yoga, and I wanted to take you guys with me on my morning routine. Um, before I was keeping water next to me, but, uh, I wasn't drinking it as much. But I've been drinking a lot more water lately because I feel so dehydrated. Um, so, yeah. I just got done doing a prenatal yoga. It was about 30 minutes. Check my avocados and see if they are looking ripe so we can eat them. Let me just set this down here. Alright. So, um... I learned a trick that someone taught me. Um, my grandma's uh, friend actually told me, um, I would put her name in here, but I don't know if she wants to be exposed or whatever or not. But anyways, thanks to her, um, if you buy like avocados or um, like fruit that's not ripe yet or vegetables that aren't ripe yet, if you put them in a paper bag for a few days, they ripen up faster. So that's what I did for my avocados. Um, another trick I learned to see if it's actually ready or not, like at a grocery store, this little thing here, they still have them on here. You just pop it off. And if it's a bright green, then it's good to go. So we're going to cut this open real quick. I'm going to get a knife here. Ten minutes of waking up. Um, a good idea would be to go straight outside. Um, it's been a little bit chilly out there, but so like, you don't have to like sit out there and meditate and all that. Um, and some people can't go outside. I'm sorry about that guys, but at least opening your windows, letting the sunshine, sh sunshine shine through is very therapeutic. Um, it really, it really helps boost the mind and get ready for the day. So since I'm still a thankful to go outside still, um, I sit out there for about like at least five minutes. Um, if it's, if it's nice out, then I'll sit out there for like 15, 20 minutes, but it's kind of cold and I don't want to get no pneumonia or nothing like that. So, and I, and I don't like to wear my shoes. So that's what another part of my morning routine. Anyways, let's get into cutting this up. Oh, here we are. I'm gonna make some avocado toast for you. All right, one second, I'll be right back when I get all the stuff out. Okay, so I found my glasses too. <laughs> um, so I actually found this nice 100% whole wheat, um, no added nonsense, <laughs> no added nonsense ingredients. Um, I wanted to find a whole wheat, like whole grain, type of bread so I can get some good fiber for my baby um, and then I have smart balance butter it's a vegan butter um, it's actually the best tasting butter I've had so that's good and then I'm gonna actually cook it in a pan um, we have a toaster but I'm trying to stay as healthy as possible and I feel like cooking it in a pan is probably better um, so we're gonna go ahead and get into that I'm gonna pause it real quick. Alright, so I got the butter on my toast. It might be too big to put both of them in here, but I kind of want to. And I'm actually gonna make, um, I'm gonna try and do my own gardening with this avocado seed when I open it up. So that'd be nice. Um, because I kind of I kind of messed that one up, so I can't use that one anymore. But I'm gonna put this bread away. Get this stuff all together, and hopefully these will be done by then, and then I'll be back. All right, so this is the end result of this avocado toast. I'm going to have some fruit on the side, yeah, and I'm actually food. going to make... We're going to eat that salsa later. Oh. And I'm actually going to make this um, this juice um, into a smoothie, but my video is getting a little too long. So I'm going to eat this and then come back to you guys. I recommend y'all get a toothbrush like this one. Um, it really cleans all everything that you need to get out of there. And... Ah! 
<laughs> I didn't mean for that to happen, but it's a spinny one, so it really gets everything, all the nooks and crannies. Don't forget to floss! Alrighty, guys, so once you brush your teeth and you floss your teeth, then you... Um, I'm actually going to put on my Invisalign, and I need to wash them out. Because I put them in a little tray to get all clean with mouthwash. So we're going to wash them out real quick, put them in, and then I'm going to get dressed, put some deodorant on, put some lotion on. Ooh, let me show you guys this nice lotion I got. Hold on. This lotion is perfect for pregnant mamas. It is Cocoa Butter Formula Palmers with Vitamin E. Um, so I'm going to put this on my belly and my breastuses so that I don't get very many stretch marks. Um, and it's just... It's just healthy for you. 24 hour moisture. So yeah, I might actually take a body shower. So I'm gonna end it here and then I'll be right back when I'm dressed. <laughs> Did you start it with that in there? So yeah. All right, so once you get dressed, um, I actually have my leggings on and then a t-shirt, but I'm really cold so I'm gonna put on this, uh, this, um, what do you call these guys? Onesie! I'm gonna put on this onesie and then I I got my lotion on already, put my deodorant on, and... No, she didn't. I'm just kidding. Yes, yeah, she did. Stop the video. No, yes. we're going. We're keeping it going. You keep doing that. Okay, we're going. Jesus Christ! <laughs> <laughs> okay, anyways. Um, before he rudely interrupted... He rudely interrupted. Um... So, so, being angry with your boyfriend is part of freaking pregnancy, <laughs> so. Is it though? Um, well, not really. I mean, being emotional, the just, mood swings. Just can't take a joke, you know. All right, we're going to end it here. Be sure to like there. and subscribe, comment down below what else you'd like to see from me, and stay in tune, and put the post bell notification bell down below to stay in tune with the mood. Till we see you again.